ovulation is a complex procedure uh, the eggs that are supposed to be ovulating are already present in the ovaries but the selection of the egg which is going to grow and uh, which is going to ovulate depends on the hormones that are released from the brain the the ovaries the whole reproductive system now a lot of eggs are selected every month but one egg grows and develops and uh, that is the egg which will ovulate the rest are it's called as atresia the process where they degenerate every month this happens a few eggs are selected one grows develops and ovulates if you look at the ovaries in detail the there are some primary follicles which are sleeping they are dormant so they you can call them as immature eggs as they keep developing under the influence of hormones which are follicle stimulating hormone luteinizing hormone estrogen etc they begin to grow and as i said a few uh, will be selected every month one ovulates and the rest are degenerated so this cycle occurs every month after it is developed the egg then ovulates and the follicle from which it ovulates is now called as a corpus luteum this is a very important part inside the ovary because this is where progesterone hormone is released from progesterone hormone brings about the development of the uterus it supports the embryo which may be formed after fertilization to grow attach itself and develop into a fetus